And welcome back gamers of all kind. It is time to watch something rated JG with me, John G. Rick's also here as well. We got a new game now, World War Z, official gameplay trailer. Uh, I've been hearing a little bit of things of this World War Z game. I hope it's going to be good. It looks very interesting, but I'm not going to say any more. Let's get right into this video, all right? The first uh, official overview gameplay trailer. Let's check it out. World War Z. Third-person shooter based on the hit Paramount film, pitting you and your friends against countless hordes of zombies. I didn't even know it was based on the movie. I mean, by World War Z, right? Here to give you a gameplay overview of our co-op campaign mode, in which you'll fight for a series of intense episodes set in striking locations from across the world. Each episode has its own overarching story, divided into three chapters made up of more focused objectives. Whether boarding okay. a hijacked train, escaping by sea, or delving into an underground facility, you looks like a lot of variety. Absolutely. Of this means when your squad first jumps into a chapter, you're going to want to stay as quiet as possible. Noise attracts zombies. Now the game it looks nice, man. I mean, it, it looks clean. You run in guns blazing. World War Z's AI director is constantly. I'm surprised on how clean it looks. Each chapter. If your squad seems to be progressing a bit too easily, don't be surprised if you run into a colossal horde just around the corner. The zombies blow them up. Team is preparing to face blow them up. With low health and resources, the AI may okay. swing things for you with an extra defensive auto turret or mortar. Knowing when it's best to run and gun, hold defensive choke points, or just sprint like crazy can be the difference between it's like squads of four, uh, left for dead style. Running down the undead, you'll also want to keep an eye out for hidden loot. You may find the occasional health kit or ammunition box in your path, but some of the best catches require leaving the beaten track. Special zombies shake things up even uh -oh. further, forcing a change. He's got the armor on. Gas bags will charge your squad, and anything but precise headshots trigger a nasty cloud of toxic gas. Screamers will cause more and more hordes to assault your team until you take them out. Easier said than done when you factor in the other special zombies that may be laying in wait. Oh, <laughs> he said gotcha. Depending on your prowess upon completing each chapter, you'll be rewarded with new perks for your chosen class and Perk system. towards upgrades for each weapon. Sounds about right in this kind of game. More, you'll be able to take on higher difficulties, meaning even greater rewards. A zombie. April 16th. April 16th is the date for it. Looks interesting. Has that four player co op, Left 4 Dead style. That third person. Has Looks a little bit like a kind of like a division kind of playthrough, just with the characters and the style of play, how it feels more like tactical style. So it looks interesting. Let me know if you guys are going to play that World War Z. Post down in the comments below if it's something you're interested in, which buddies you guys are going to be playing it with. And uh, when it comes to this channel, I do reactions not only just on video games, but on uh, TVs, on film, anything under the sun that you guys think of. Check it out. You guys won't be disappointed, alright? Take care. Have a good one.